Welcome back. So glad that you've joined me today. Now, it doesn't matter how old someone is, each one of us likes new things. Maybe it's the fact that it's shinier, or the fact that it's just brand new that draws an appeal to each one of us. You know, walk down the aisles of a grocery store or even convenience store or whatever, when we see the sign that says new, a lot of times we're attracted to that. And more often times than not, we say that this is something that we have to have when probably we really don't need it. Now, as we look at God's Word from Genesis to Revelation, God continues to remind us how everything that He's doing is a new thing. When was the last time that we actually stopped and we realized that God is about the business of doing new and great things in our lives and in the wonders of the universe? Today's verse that we're looking at comes to us from Isaiah chapter 43 and verse 19. And it says this, it says, See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up. Do you not perceive it? I am making a way in the desert and streams in the wasteland. Amazing news right there. Right there, God is speaking through Isaiah to the children of Israel, reminding them about what he has done, but what he's planning on doing as well. God's plans are more infinite than we can ever imagine. He's asking us to come along with him on this ride that we call life. Our question that we need to ask is, are we willing to take this journey? And even more, are we willing to allow God to create, create us into the new things and the new people that he has planned? As we continue to journey together, and even more, as we journey with God, let our continual prayer be, yes, Lord, change me into what and who you would have me to be so that I can be better used by you. Thank you again for joining me today. I look forward to seeing you next time as we continue to study God's Word together. God bless.